Hello friends. I welcome you all to TechMite. I hope you all are doing well. You all might have heard about the word AI or artificial intelligence. Some of you might have known about this and some are maybe still confused. Don't worry my friends. Here I am to dispel your doubts. Let's start with the definition. The intelligence demonstrated by machines is known as artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence has grown to be very popular in today's world. It is the simulation of natural intelligence in machines that are programmed to learn and mimic the actions of humans. These machines are able to learn with experience and perform human-like tasks. As technologies such as AI continue to grow, they will have a great impact on our quality of life. If you ask what artificial intelligence is then the short answer to this is that it depends on who you ask. A layman with a fleeting understanding of technology would link it to robots. They'd say artificial intelligence is a terminator-like figure that can act and think on its own. If you ask about artificial intelligence to an AI researcher, he would say that it's a set of algorithms that can produce results without having to be explicitly instructed to do so. And they would all be right. So to summarize, artificial intelligence meaning is an intelligent entity created by humans, capable of performing tasks intelligently without being explicitly instructed, capable of thinking and acting rationally and humanely. Types of AI 1. Artificial Narrow Intelligence 2. Artificial General Intelligence 3. Artificial Super Intelligence Artificial Narrow Intelligence is the most common form of AI that you'd find in the market now. These artificial intelligence systems are designed to solve one single problem and would be able to execute a single task really well. By definition, they have narrow capabilities like recommending a product for an e-commerce user or predicting the weather. Artificial general intelligence is still a theoretical concept. It is defined as AI which has a human level of cognitive function across a wide variety of domains such as language processing, image processing, computational functioning and reasoning and so on. We're almost entering into science fiction territory here, but artificial superintelligence is seen as the logical progression from artificial general intelligence. An artificial superintelligence system would be able to surpass all human capabilities. This would include decision making, taking rational decisions, and even includes things like making better art and building emotional relationships. Now a question may arise in your mind that where is AI used? Let me tell you. AI is used in different domains to give insights into user behavior and give recommendations based on the data. For example, Google's predictive search algorithm used past user data to predict what a user would type next in the search bar. Netflix uses past user data to recommend what movie a user might want to see next, making the user hooked onto the platform and increase watch time. Facebook uses past data of the users to automatically give suggestions to tag your friends based on their facial features and their images. AI is used everywhere by large organizations to make an end user's life simpler. Let's discuss about advantages of artificial intelligence. It reduces human errors. It is available 24 by 7. It provides digital assistance. It helps in repetitive works. It helps in faster and rational decision making. All the things that have advantages also have disadvantages. Disadvantages of AI are Its cost overruns. It causes dearth of talent. It is potential for misuse. That's all for today guys. If you like the video or learned something then please support me by liking it, sharing it, commenting on it and subscribing to my YouTube channel. If you want to see helpful and informative posts on technology then do follow me on Instagram. I will put the link in the description. Thanks.